Let's let them know who really got it. Came up from the bottom, now we riding in a mozzie. And these my jealous done burnt the hole in my pocket. See me, I'm shining. Yo, what's up, guys? It is your boy Bugs, and today, guys, we're gonna be talking about what the main game mode should be for T Rex KO. The game also known as Project L. And before we get into the video, I actually want to just get y'all updated if y'all aren't already. And if you are, then you can skip forward. But yeah, let's get into it. So, 2XKO is the name they decided for Project L. Because Project L is always going to be a placeholder. It was never going to be the name of the game. And yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of the name. Um, But I don't think the name makes the game. But, you know, it's definitely... <laughs> An interesting one <laughs> but yeah um but also if you didn't know they also dropped a trailer pretty much you know showing case in the name and um giving us pretty much a game plan for 2024 and 2025 so 2024 is the playtest era we're gonna be playtesting the game in um iro at lands and stuff um also it seems like they're gonna want to do like some type of pop-up um areas too um at locations and also online not sure when that's gonna happen but yeah you can go check that video out on youtube my tiktok twitter it's all over the place and in 2025 is when they're looking to release the game on ps5 um xbox s and x series and then pc obviously awesome now let's get straight into the topic what should the main game mode be for 2x ko because if you don't know this game you could play solos or duos or 1v2s so that means you could play 1v1 each person is um controlling two characters 2v2 um you and your teammate is controlling one character and you can swap out and you know vice versa and then finally 1v2 where one person is controlling two pe um two people while two people are controlling each one and one now at first my take was only for the competitive side it was like oh for the competitive side for this i would love to see them all together because one bigger prize pool two great storylines from teams that we will probably never see um go against each other because they decided to play by themselves or because they decided to play twos but Overall, I think the game should just be one big game mode where you are allowed to play by yourself or with a partner and go against someone um, by themselves or with a partner. Um, because the main thing is to not separate the community. We don't need to, you know, split up as in like, oh, I only want to play ones and play one person at a time. Oh, I only want to play twos and play two people at a time. There's no, well, there's a small difference, I guess, in skill when it comes to that. Because if you don't know, you haven't really, really keeping up with the game. But pretty much when they showcased it. Um, there are pros and cons of having a partner and not having a partner. For example, the pro of not having a partner is that whatever combo you learn and etc., you know, you don't have to worry about another person making a mistake or having an error in your gameplay. While the pro of having, you know, two people is if you have two brains with one, um, let's say if you're having a hard matchup of one character, guess what? Swap out. Hey, my partner is better at, I'm dealing with this than me, then they could go in. Also better combos. Um, if yeah, I have the chemistry to do it because um, I think there's like certain things where you could hold things longer while your partner is still doing certain combos where if you're by yourself, you couldn't because, you know, you're controlling one person at a time where the other person can kind of like assist themselves in and do other moves. And but then again, the, the pro of being by yourself is that there is less errors from mistakes because it's you doing all the controls and you don't have to effortly, you know, like rely on somebody else. So there's pros and cons of playing by yourself and with somebody. But I think that's more of the fun. And then going back into the whole competitive scene, you know, obviously we won a big prize pool. Come on, it's Riot. But the other thing is the storyline. I think the storyline will be humongous to actually see all the storylines be possible, then be cut off because, oh, this person decided to play by himself. Oh, this these two decided to play as a team. So we can never see them face each other because they're focusing on the twos version of the game. This They're focusing on the ones version of the game. When in reality, the game already allows one of you twos we might as well has that in the esports because now we can see someone like Leffen, right? Go against someone like Nikat and Void, you know, because um, they're, they're, they're duels and like, I think it was Smash and uh, Multiverses. Then you have Leffen that's just been like an OG of solo player. So imagine we see those two go head to head or we see Sonic Fox by himself versus two Street Fighter top players and they decided to team instead of going by themselves. And we can see that storyline. I think it's just endless and it just would be a beautiful scene for the G um, for the FGC. That's just my opinion. I would love to hear your thoughts on that because that's pretty much it for the video. There <laughs> ain't really much else to say about it. But yeah, I would definitely think for the games, like main game mode and just the, the one game mode is to allow 1v1, 1v2, 1v1 um, all together, in my honest opinion. But leave the comments down below what y'all think about that. Do y'all think we should have splits in 1v1s, 2v2s for people that just want to play by themselves with another person by themselves and 2v2s etc i personally don't think there's a difference because it's still the same gameplay technically small differences but yeah 
Um, leave a like if you like the video, comment anything. Again, you know, I love y'all comments, and I would really want to get y'all opinions on this um, topic and situation for the game before it releases. And it's your first time ever watching uh, one of my videos, and do you do want to see more 2x KO? It's going to get some time to get used to, but some 2x KO news, gameplay, tips and tricks, and etc. I'm going to be here for it, guys, and I'll see y'all later. Peace. Yeah, she got a man she don't really give a fuck about. Left him back home in a whole nother state. Moved to LA because she want to be famous. Got another five on the side. She a waitress, but it's getting tough. Hard to find out.